Welcome everybody. In this video I want to teach you how to design a simple model of SSP modulation in the MATLAB Simulink. In the view from library browsing we first need signal generator. We drag it into the Simulink places and next we need Ray Transition. We drag this one and put it in the Simulink space. And after that we need SSP modulator which we right here SSP AM here is the modulator and next to the modulator we need the modulator and finally we need power spectral density That's the average, we do not need that one, we need power spectral density, not the average one. The signal came from signal generator to the rate transition and then to the SSP modulator and after that to the SSP AM the modulator and finally it goes to the power spectral density. By double click on any item we can set a parameter of it. I just give you a sample but you can change it based on your project or anything that you have. For the frequency I choose signal generator 10 Hz. I change rod per second to Hz and OK. For a transition we do not need to do anything. By double click on SSP modulator I set a carrier frequency at 150 Hz sideband to modulate lower okay and then for the demodulator I choose the carrier frequency again at the same frequency 150 Hz and cutoff frequency of 150 Hz That's okay. For the power spectral density, I choose this one 512 and then plot after 512 points. And I choose sample time as 0 0.001. Okay. We need other power spectral density for seeing that what is happening to the signal in different stages and when one time we set our parameter in one of them we can just right click on it and copy and paste it and it gives you the same item with the same setting so I want one sample after modulator and one of them before modulator. I just set the name of them in order, power spectral one, two, and three, that you can see the output better. So we get one sample before modulator, one of them after modulator, and one of them after the modulator. By click on this item, we can set a configuration parameter setting I choose stop time at one second and type fixed step and then solver I choose ODE5. For fixed step size I choose I change just the auto to the 0 0.001 and then I click that one automatically handle rate transition for data transfer. Okay and we run it. 
I just set them in order that you can see what's gonna happen to the signal here is the AM modulation and you can see the data and the signal together at this picture and here is after the modulation Next, I'm going to add bandstop filter to this model. So from library, uh, we write analog filter design, filter design, and we choose this one. So I'm going to place it between the modulator and the modulator that's here I just set the analog filter parameter the type we need band stop filter order 10 and lower pass band frequency is 155 multiplied by 2 multiplied by pi just consider it is rod per second and for upper pass band edge frequency I said 165 multiplied by 2 multiplied by pi that's okay in here I want to get a sample from here And after SSP modulator, we need to add a rate transition, which we copy and paste it. And we add it between the modulator and the analog filter. And also we need another rate transition between the filter and the modulator, which I put it here. I get a sample from here and then very simple we just run it and I set the signal in the order that you can see what's gonna happen to them and that's it very simple model of SSP modulation in the MATLAB Simulink Thanks for watching.